the Sudan regions of Darfur and South Kordofan are often in the news for security reasons. But from the 18th of June to the 1st of July, it will be all about football. They host 12 teams in this year's Kafa club competition, Kagami Cup. Group A features Sudan side Marek El Fashar, Rwanda's APR, Somalia's Elam, and Burundi's Vital O. APR is among the favorites in the group alongside local side Marek El Fasher. Burundi champions Vital O, however, are confident. No team prepares for a tournament to lose and we are ready to go win the tournament or even reach the final. Teams from Kenya and Tanzania, including tournament defending champions Yanga, pulled out of the competition on security grounds. Vital O are, however, confident the organizers will ensure teams are secure. With 18 league titles, Vital O is Burundi's most successful club domestically. But they have been unable to replicate this success both at the regional and continental level. At this year's Sekafa Club Championships in Sudan, the club will be hoping to break that jinx. It's about time Vital O showed that they can move from being just national to regional champions. In a country where football is underfunded, regional tournaments offers players an opportunity to market themselves and maybe earn professional contracts away from home. Each player is hoping to get there and put on a good show in order to get a professional contract abroad or in Africa. This is because our economy isn't good and so football doesn't pay at home. We have problems here in Burundi and players are always looking to leave the local clubs. This means that as a coach, you're always rebuilding your team with each new season and this breaks a team's consistency. Vital O opened their campaign against Marek El Fasher on Wednesday. Coach Kanyankore has worked with Vital O for over two decades and will be hoping his team can finally break their regional jinx and lift their first club title away from home. Celestine Karone, CCTV, Bujubura, Burundi.